All right, what is up, y'all? It's the Sandman back at it again, and today we're doing another reaction to a new band on the channel. It's a band that I'm, of course, familiar with, um, and I know a lot of you guys probably love. I think most people probably love this band, Red Hot Chili Peppers. We're looking at their Slain Castle performance. I believe we're probably their most legendary live performance. Um, at least it's the most popular live performance that I've seen like on YouTube in terms of views. I haven't watched all of them, um, but I think from what I've been seeing, this is definitely a must react for you know guys who want to react to chili peppers and things like that so today we're looking at a song um called other side and i want to see man i want to see because i know john frusciante's in in this performance killer guitar player one of my inspirations um and of course you got flea you got the energetic anthony kiedis and you got will ferrell on drums so that's what else is there to say, man. So I'm going to sit back, enjoy the show. And um, yeah, so this is Other Side. And let's see what they got. Oh, I missed a sneeze. Oh, I'm sorry. I mean, I'm sorry. I didn't want to ruin the flow of the video, so I had to pause it there. But man, Fushanti's backing vocals are crazy in this song. They're absolutely beautiful. Um, I forgot he could sing. I really forgot he could sing. But he can. They were a killer, man. Um, you know, I forgot how dark this song is, too. I, I really listened to what he's saying. and I, I listened to, like... What people think it might be about in drug addiction, um, depression, and um, you know relapse and going going back and taking on the sort of demons that enter your head whenever you you know be pretty much because of drugs you've done in the past or things like that, um, and it's a it's a very emotional song. Uh, I forgot I forgot how much like you know this song used to like really. Sp pull at my heartstrings, you know, back then. And I'm feeling that same type of way. I think live adds a whole new element to it as well. But great stuff so far. Let me go back a little bit more.
hear that last part again. How do you hit that note? What are you doing on your phone? I'm sorry, I left a I really gotta, I really gotta remember to turn on that block. Anyways, wow, that was beautiful. Um, wow, that was great, man. The vocals, the backing vocals, for something that completely adds a new punch to the song that you don't really hear in the studio version. Um, and Flea's bass lines were killer, too. Be the backing vocals and Flea's bass lines are, are really what are my favorite parts about this performance in particular. Um, and as far as the song goes, I, I really do like the... Um, the melody is very haunting. It sounds very haunting melodically. Even the vocal melodies, um, but also the little chords that uh, John's playing in the background. Um, the single notes, it's not like... It's not like a wall of sound that hits you but it's very delicately played and it, it, it's just layered very nicely it's very um how do i put it it doesn't need to be complicated you know it doesn't need to be overproduced it just needs to be it just needs to be there it just has to be the right notes and that's exactly what they what they do um but yeah that and also i love that the switch the switch up in the middle the uh the breakdown that they do there um in the i guess you call it the bridge i love that part of the song as well um because you have this sort of reflection reminiscing and reflecting on the the situation at hand with you know the drug addiction from the past that's coming creeping up back into your life then you acknowledge it and you sort of have this sort of anger this anger and this like um you know you, you can It energizes you at the same time, you know what I'm saying? Bring, bringing that into that breakdown. And then um, it concludes with the chorus again. So what else is there to say? And very good stuff, man. Love the love the vocals. Um, and I just love the song in general. So this is... The crowd was going crazy, too. The crowd looked amazing. It looked huge. It looked packed, man. Um, yeah, I, may, I miss it. I miss all of that, you know what I'm saying? But at least this, you know, whatever pandemic is coming to an end... Uh, I definitely gotta hit a concert very soon. Definitely gonna hit a concert very soon, man. Um, so yeah, that's it, guys. And if you guys like the video, please like and subscribe for more Chili Peppers or any other band, basically, that you want me to react to. Um, I will be reading the comments, and I'll be taking those suggestions, and hope y'all also add your input on what you like about the song or this performance or other performances by um, the bands that I react to. So... That's it from the Sandman, guys. Like, subscribe. Y'all have a blessed night, day, whenever you're watching this. Peace.